So what's up YouTubers? This is a very special video on Joel for Joel's comment talk. I got some cool graded uh comment backs. Uh it's been a long time since my buddy Spider Man's uh done a video with me, so I thought I'd bring in him. Uh don't you agree, Spider Man? Yes I do. He definitely agrees. So I got some cool graded comments that I wanna show you guys quickly. Uh first one is Web of Spider Man on uh, uh, number ninety. Uh, it has the hologram uh, cover, pretty cool. It's uh, centerfold of Spider-Man 2099. So this was way back in 1992. So the grade is uh, 9.8. So I'm very happy. Uh, it's not, not quite a gem, but it's pretty close to near mint. So uh, value-wise on this is about a $100 comic uh, versus a $10 comic. So pretty happy. So another hologram cover I got was Spider-Man number 26. Uh, this is volume two, uh, not volume one. So uh, Spider-Man number 26, uh, hologram cover. Again, I love these hologram covers. Don't you guys uh, agree? So this is 9.4. So this is 0.2 less than the other one, but still. Um, I saw on eBay, it sold, the last one sold for about uh, $70, so not quite as high as I want, but still it's going in my personal collection. I'm very happy I got all the hologram ones now graded. This took about uh, seven months for these ones to come back, so way back in the summertime, I sent them in. Quite a long time, right, Spider-Man? Yes, he's agreeing with me, so uh, pretty cool. So, so next hologram one I got is the Spectacular Spider-Man. Um, number 189. So there is the Green Goblin and Molten Man appearance in this one. So the grade is uh, 9.6. So pretty happy. Another high, almost near mint uh, coffee. Uh, again, this is about another 100 to $150. I haven't looked up the value of this one close enough. So uh, pretty cool. I Again, uh, very ecstatic. It took, it, it did take seven months. And this is from 92 as well. So this is that early 90s comic. So next one I want to show you guys is Amazing Spider-Man 313. Um, in volume 1. So it is from 1989. And the listed appearance is this. So uh, it's not the high grade that I thought it was. I thought it would be a little near to near mint. But it is 8.0. So which means it's very... It says fine, fine, somewhere around there. So what is it? So what are, it is white pages, so that's good. Uh, but uh, there's Tom Rutherford, he does the cover art. So it's still pretty valuable, it's still worth a lot of money. So it is very good. So next one I want to show you is Amazing Spider-Man 307 uh, from 1988. And the charm appearance, which is this guy here. And the great is... Uh, 8.5, so it's a little higher than th this last one, but still, uh, not bad for how old it is. It's from 1988, there's white pages, so again, uh, pretty cool. If you are going to get a comics graded, you have to be careful. It's, uh, it takes about seven to eight months for the, uh, your, after your comic shop, uh, sends the box in. Shipping does take a long time to get to the States. So last one I want to show you guys. Is Amazing Spider-Man 309. First appearance of Sticks of Stone. So it is uh, with, with these guys here on the cover. So the grade is 9.4. Again, uh, cover art by Tom McFarland. These are all Tom McFarland uh, runs when he was working on the Amazing Spider-Man way back in the 80s. Uh, this is from 1988. This is off-white to white pages. Uh, meaning the pages are a little bit... Um, off meaning they're not perfectly uh white so it there you so yes these are my next set batch of uh spider-man uh comments that i had great what do you think spider-man did i do good he he definitely agrees with me so uh spider-man and i thank you for joining us for uh this very special youtube so these are some cool um um graded comments that i got and like I said, I do have uh, 12 more uh, that I sent in uh, on my day off. I did go to the comic book store and I was pick these up. And that will be my last big batch that I will 
said you, you won't see those cars for for seven months. So, uh, but after that, I'll just be sending in two or three at a time. I do have a good list of older new cars in this uh, next batch I sent in. So my my comment tip on the day is if you're gonna uh, get graded comments, try and do some of your older ones first. You never know, uh, you might get, be happy to get uh, begging for your butt for them because now that they're graded, they're gonna be worth a little bit more. So I'm very happy with these. So I can't wait to uh, showcase them later on. So um, be on the lookout on Sunday for, I did also get a new stack of comments in my file. So I'll be showing you guys what I got. I may spread it up into two, into two or three parts because I did get quite a stack and maybe Spider-Man will join me in one of those videos. Won't you Spider-Man? Yes, he agrees with me for the there. So uh, for Joe's comment talk, I, uh, I'd like to thank you for joining me here for uh, I'm calling this graded comments because I did get some graded comments. So very happy and we'll see you guys on Sunday. Thanks everybody.